Hey Jeremy, I think it's pink. This is Exploring with the Nug. My name is Jeremy, and today we're gonna be diving in this section of the river to see what kind of amazing treasures we can find. Man, bro, you been working out? I have been working out. Dude. Oh, river treasure. All right, so we got Adam Brown Adventures here. Got himself a nice new seven mil. I do. Are you good? Think it'll be warm? Gently used, but yeah, I'm pretty warm. My arms don't really stay down, but uh. That's I'm cool. not gonna be freezing to death, so that's always a good good thing. You know? All right, what are we gonna find today? This is your favorite Dude, spot I, on the hoop. This is the best spot ever, man. We've, we've come out here so many times, found so many amazing treasures from, you know, iPhones that are still turned on to guns, so all types, it's a whole range. We even found like antique, old, like a World War II rifle you found, right? Sure did. So that was pretty crazy. I think today we're gonna find, like, I'm thinking a pickaxe or something. Oh, I like, or like that. Like a big axe of some sort. That's my that's my guess. That's what I'm feeling. So we'll see what happens. All right. And we got Johnny here from Georgia River Boys and his kid. I guess that technically means you're the Georgia River Boys, plural. Boys. Cool. Even though he's not diving today. I don't know. What's up with that? You cold? Cold. Whatever. We're gonna get him a dry suit. He'll be diving soon. Oh yeah, that's 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 what you gotta do. What do you want to find today? Um. Well, you know this spot. I'm definitely looking for some phones, but. I want to find some type of weapon. A weapon. That's my goal. Well, anything can be used as a weapon, so you can come out of the bag of rocks and be like, I found some weapons. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Introductions are out of the way. I'm going to go over here and get my gear on, and I want to show you guys something. Check out this strikingly handsome young man. This is Mike, and Mike is the owner of Dive Right In Scuba, and this guy has literally been helping me out since I started my channel. With, with like, he took a huge risk on me, and I have... I've been waiting for the right opportunity to thank him and to tell you guys all about what he does. What I'm wearing right now is a Hollis dry suit. And thanks to all the wonderful viewers such as yourselves, you guys raised up enough money for me to offer Mike and he hooked me up with a huge discount for this uh, for this dry suit. So pretty much what I wanted to say was thank you to all of my wonderful viewers for coming together and hooking me up so I don't freeze to death in these rivers. And to Mike and his crew at Dive Right In Scuba for taking care of me and putting me in a dry suit at an amazing discount. He hooked me up and what's really cool is he's gonna hook you guys up too. All you gotta do is just hit him up and tell him what you need. He is a very understanding guy, he's a business owner, he is, he is just like you and me. If you guys want to do me the best favor ever, go to Dive Right In Scuba and do some shopping. You could buy anything from a t-shirt to a flashlight. They actually have one of these flashlights that I'm holding right here, and it's called a 950, no joke, number 950. And uh, it's an amazing light. I use it underwater when I'm searching the cars. Uh, it's not for filming, it's for actually looking at stuff. So it's very bright, very accurate, and very affordable. Go check that out. And if you don't want to buy anything, just go to Dive Right In Scuba's Google review, drop them a five-star review, telling them how much they appreciate them helping me out because they've been with me since the beginning. They haven't got any return yet. They've invested a lot of time and energy and money into me. So let's thank them properly. Let's come together. And with your help, Mike and his crew will feel well more appreciated for hooking me up. And all the contact information and all the other cool little things are gonna be linked in the description down below. All you gotta do is go to the link, click it, and then go hook me up by hooking them up. Once again, I appreciate all the wonderful viewers because without you guys, I could not be where I am today, which is at the river, making more amazing content just for you. With that being said, let's get the rest of the gear on, get in the water, and let's go have an amazing day filming content and finding treasures. All ready. Oh! 
Turn the car down! This dry suit makes things a lot harder. I got some learning to do, but it's definitely a fun day. I lost, yeah, I lost my dang treasure bag. So all the stuff that I found today, gone. That really irritates me. So I got nothing to show you guys, but I'm sure everybody else has something awesome. So let's get out of the water and we'll regroup, meet up with them right now. Okay, we are out of the water. And like I said, when I was getting out of the water, uh, I lost my treasure bag, dude. I'm so irritated about that because I did find lots of cool stuff. I was struggling to stand her water. I still got a lot to learn with this dry suit. For one, getting more weight. I had like not enough weight. So I was doing lots of floating. It was kind of a disaster, but you know what? We got to learn somehow. So anyways, while we're here, let's go check out what some of the other guys found because they actually had a productive day and they brought their treasures with them. So there you go. A little cold out there, man. It got a little chilly. That was fine. I heard you uh, aren't happy right now. No, I was we hoping somebody would come out with my bag, but it doesn't look like it. We got Adam Brown here out of the water. He had a way better day than I did. Why don't you show us what you got? Man, I had a great day today. I was a little worried because I wasn't finding anything for like an hour, and then I hit the jackpot. It was like bam, 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 bam. So first, I came across, check it out, this GoPro Hero 9. And when I saw it, it blended in because all you know all the rocks down there are black. Yeah. They look exactly like this. So, I, but luckily that was sitting on top, and I was right in my face. I'm like, heck yeah, it's a Hero Nine. That's the camera I use. That's a nice one. They just came out with the ten. So, and Dibs. second cool thing I found. Check it out, DJI drone, dude. Last time I was out at this spot, I found a drone, and I found one today. And I got, bet it's gonna have the memory card in there. Are you gonna put your uh, put put the the footage on your channel i will if you guys want to see the uh lost drone footage another lost drone footage go to my channel oh yeah. and uh the last thing i found that was really cool i found a wallet with somebody's id cards in there a guy named paul so i'm gonna try to get that returned to paul although it said it expired in 2014 so Dude, that'd be a good story if you it is gonna be a to good him, story so. yeah, but hey paul stuff. how'd you lose this <laughs> yeah paul what are you doing with your wallet out on the river i found a bunch of the cool stuff you're gonna have to go check out my channel you want to see the rest of it though <laughs> all right johnny ringo what'd you find big sea clam man big I, sea clam i bet this was there from when they were making the bridge maybe it's got some a m huh initials we'll call oh, yeah. him we'll call him alex michelle alex martin alex martin found a hammer got the hammer um a million golf balls yeah. got the cassette tape is there anything on it i mean like a a writing on it? I didn't see anything. I was looking. I was hoping, looking underwater. Oh, well. 
Um, a bullet, no, no major finds today. Um, we thought so, that was gonna be good. Yeah, so this was what, two rocks that are just tied together to make an anchor or something? Yeah, I thought something was gonna be in there, but overall it was a great day. Just didn't find a lot, but got a lot of garbage out. Indeed. Why can't I just have one video where everything goes right? It seems like every video that I do, I end up losing something or breaking something. You know what? That is my luck, but whatever. Once again, I want to thank Dive Right In Scuba. Mike and his crew hooked me up with that dry suit, and all the viewers like you helped me get that dry suit to begin with. Please go drop some emails or some good comments to Mike at Dive Right In Scuba. Actually, his email is Mike at Dive Right In Scuba.com. Send him some emails, go give him some good Google reviews, and tell him Nug sent you and Nug appreciates you. It would mean a lot to me and it would mean a lot to him. And ultimately, everybody wins out of the deal. Until we meet again, my name is Jeremy. I will see you guys on the next dive. Woo!